Movement Speaks. Dixon Gottschild emphasized the barrier of tension between words and movement. She describes how movement is the embodied language and how you have to go through your body to talk. Dance is my emotional outlet. Dance is like just like creative like expression that like everyone can use. It's a way for me to get comfortable in my body and express myself. Dance to me is the unspoken language of the soul. I know for a fact that I wouldn't be able to find the right words to say it in. I try to express whether it's aggression, happiness, um, joy, all the emotions that you can think of. It's my style of dancing. Um, it's always not clear, but whenever I do it, I feel it. Really cool feeling when, um, like everything just flows right, like the movements going with like one of our music officers, like no music. Um, like it's just like this like really cool feeling of just like, oof, like peace I guess. Or like if this, like the dance is kind of like more vigorous or whatever, it's just like so energizing. And I, I feel more comfortable, which is kind of contradictory, like some people it makes them uncomfortable to dance. But for me, it's, I guess it helps me to express myself. Dance, because uh, I feel like it's a very unique way to express how you feel without actually having to physically say any words. When I'm dancing, I usually try to put a story in my head or a reason, a character for me, to, for the choreography, and a certain emotion that I'm trying to portray. And then I can completely feel that emotionally. And it's with me to like get my emotions out, I guess. <laughs> I like being able to express myself. Just using my body, like not having to write anything down or say anything. I can just do it right there and I feel like it's very real. A form of communication. When I dance, I kind of am expressing myself through my movement. When you're dancing in a group of people, you like feel their energy and you sort of um, are communicating with them. And then like as a performer, you're communicating something with the audience to get them to relate to you in a way. Relax. And be myself. Everything that is deep down that you don't really want expressed in words, you can express by dancing. and and people won't really understand what you're talking about, <laughs> but, well, but you will, it'll come out with your dance. My biggest obstacle as a dancer and as a person has been having confidence in my abilities. I guess I like, just started like taking dance classes. I wanted to be like more girly, I guess, I don't know, because I was always into sports. So I am a generally shy person. Uh, so, like, dancing has helped me become outgoing. I was a competitive dancer. And basically, in the world of competition, it's all about tricks and what you can do and, like, how high you can leap and how many turns you can do. And so I came here and I was like, oh my god, I'm really nervous. <laughs> I guess before coming here, I had never done modern. The more experience I've gained as a dancer has tremendously changed my outlook on my capabilities as a dancer. I look at myself now and see how much I've grown and have found a new appreciation for being able to express myself through movement. Coming to Appalachian, my concept of movement has drastically changed. I don't know if it's necessarily changed dramatically, but mm -hmm. definitely um, I've grown as a dancer here. It is more about what you feel and expressing yourself, and it gave me more of a deeper connection to the movement, because before it was just like, oh my god, I have to do this many turns, and now it's like, 
if it feels good, then it's dancing. Like, now I know that any movement is dancing, if it, like, means something to you. We live our everyday lives just with our minds, you know, just constantly walking around every day with our minds. We don't really, like, focus on our bodies at all. Um, we just sort of forget about them, even though they're these amazing things that do so many great things for us. I think dance at app has definitely helped me to just sort of appreciate the body that I'm in. Ultimately, Martha Graham sums up how much dance means to me by saying, to dance is to be out of yourself, larger, more beautiful, more powerful. This is the power, it is the glory on earth, and it is yours for the taking.